Hey Eric, I hope that you're doing well. Sorry that I didn't um, get to you yesterday. I actually was recording my update and all of a sudden I got a horrible migraine. I started seeing like an orbit, orbit on the screen and I was like, okay, this is distracting and I need to stop. So I just went and laid down and I feel a lot better today. I just have like a huge like pressure headache um, just from um, having that migraine, but I took some medication last night because um, I'm pre I am prescribed medication for migraines and um, it helped a lot. It like worked within like 30 minutes, but I still felt like crap. I hate those. Usually I only get them like once every couple of months. So at least it's not like a really like reoccurring event, but it does happen to me a lot. Um, but anyway, um, on to my update. So last week was super busy with school. I had two really hard tests. Um, and then I had all these assignments on top of that and then all this other stuff. And then the weekend was super busy. I went with my dad to a food truck festival, which was really, really fun. I ended up getting like some waffle, um, type. It was like a waffle with fried chicken in it, cheese, bacon, and honey mustard. It was delicious. And then my dad got one, and it was a waffle with fried chicken in it with spicy maple syrup. I liked his a lot better than mine, um, but mine was still really good. I just loved the sweet like type stuff. And then, um, what else? Oh, and then that day I met with my clinical instructor, instructor for my past eight-week clinical, and that was a lot of fun. I got to keep, like, keep, or... Sorry, I got to um, find out about my old patients and everything like that. So that was a lot of fun um, listening about that and catching up with her. And then on Sunday, it was my grandpa's birthday. So he came down and we all went to Fuddruckers and we had, um, we ate lunch and stuff. I had like a turkey burger, but I didn't even realize like the turkey burgers have like 800 calories in them. But whatever, they're huge, they have a lot of protein in them, and they were still good, um, so also, let me get to my update, oh yeah, and then my Poshmark stats, um, I've sold like $400 now, and I ended up, like, becoming really obsessed with the app, and it's just taking away a lot of my time, like, you have to share everyone else's stuff, and they have to share yours so more people can see your items in your closet and you get more followers. And, like, it's just, like, a constant thing. Like, I'm having to share all this crap. And I think I don't want to do that anymore because it's taking way too much of my time. And I just don't think it's worth my time. It's just a hard, I don't know. But still, I made pretty good money so far. Um, also, um... Let me know your Poshmark name and uh, have you been, have you sold anything yet? Um, if you have, that's awesome. But anyway, maybe like a yard sale would be easier now that I'm thinking about it. But I still have made pretty good money off of it. Okay, so now on to the update. So where did that go? All right, so um, I... I'm pretty sure I'm on like this week I'm on that last week of my building block or my block on this phase and I've liked it a lot my waist and hip measurements were the same um 35 waist and 24.7 um I mean 24.7 waist and hip is 35 um I'm not taking any new supplements, no more fluid than usual or sodium, except actually this past weekend. <laughs> um, stress levels um, were high last week. Um, sleep was bad. Like, there was one day that I, like, a couple days in a row, I only had, like, four hours of sleep. And then, um, I didn't hit my macros well. Um, I actually... So last week I felt really crappy because the week before, weekend before, I actually went on a date with some guy besides the one in Texas, and um, I he was like from my high school, and we went out and we went hiking and awesome, and it's like peak season here for the leaves, 
So we went hiking and then we ended up eating at a food truck. And then the next day, like I ate somewhere else, I can't remember, but I ate out again. It's full like crap. So like the whole week, like I didn't meet my macros at all. And then this past weekend, I didn't eat, meet my macros either. Um, and I honestly, I haven't weighed myself. Um, so I started hitting my macros yesterday and I still need to weigh myself for some reason. I just don't, um, honestly, I don't want to look at the scale. But I haven't been meeting my macros like I've been way under. So, and I also just realized that I wasn't even meeting my, uh, or my, or not calories, uh, my hit. Like I was, yeah, last week I did all my cardio like usual, like on my diet things. And I didn't realize that you had cut it down until this past week. So I'm going to get back on track. I'm going to meet all my macros. It's like time to start doing the lean phase now. Like I'm back on my macros as of Monday. Uh, yesterday. No, by the way. Um, but yeah, last week was a really good training week for me. Um, physically, I feel um, fine, honestly. Currently on my training week, uh, I'm on the last block. Um, level of soreness. I would say like a one. Honestly, I'm not sore. Did you complete all? Yes, I did. I completed all my training and cardio days. Mentally, I feel really good. Um, just need to get back refocused, getting into those macros and that lean building phase. Um, now that I'm back on track with my stuff, energy and strength levels are good. Um, oh, one exercise I am struggling with is the lat pull down. Okay, so I feel fine. I get all my reps in or whatever. And by the end of it, oh my God, like I just feel like my endurance for my back is so bad. Like it is hard for me to get like 13 or 14 reps in. Like I want to like die. <laughs> Maybe that's a good thing though. But like by the time I have my second set, it's hard for me to reach those reps again. So like I think I have really bad endurance or I'm not resting long enough. I don't know. Same as for my pull-ups. Like I find myself like I can't do as many reps the next set. Um, I did get more activity in. I've been walking and everything and hiking. I didn't travel at all. And I did eat over the weekend. Like I said, I went to the food uh, food truck festival and measuring my progress via my family, friends, and how my clothes are fit. Um, nothing really in regards to um, my macros. Um, and overall, I feel really good about everything. And breaking news is that I have officially gotten my apartment now for San Antonio and I contacted my new clinical instructor and he seems really cool and awesome and he um, he is um, Mexican and he has been like served in the Navy and everything and he seems like a complete badass and I can't wait to meet him um, I can't wait all right well I hope that you have a great day and sorry again, that took me so long um, to contact you and I'll get you your payment this week in a couple of days. I think my mom gets paid Thursday, so that'll probably be the day. All right. I hope you have a great day. Oh, and also tell me how you like Stranger Things. Um, I really loved it. I actually finished it like two weeks ago um, when it first came out and I got me a cool... Hold on. Look at this tacky sweater. It says run. It's for my tacky Christmas sweater party for uh, my Christmas 